They give us a circle with intersecting chords, and we need to determine the value of x so that it could find a length of kz. So for us to do this, we're going to have to use the intersecting chords theorem. So we're basically doing w times l times l times p is going to be equal to k times l times l times z. So when we set this actual problem up, what we're saying is 2 times 3x minus 2 is going to be equal to 5 times x or x times 5. So we have 6x minus 4 is equal to 5x. Once we simplify, we're going to have negative 4 is equal to negative x. So I know x is going to be equal to positive 4, but that's not the answer. When we substitute it in, right, for lz, and we simplify 3 times 4 is 12, 12 minus 2 is going to give us 10. But remember, they ask not for lz, but for kz. So after we have 10, we're going to have to add that last 2 to get an answer choice of 12. And D is going to be our correct answer. And this is how you would properly solve these type of geometry problems.